While contemporary Indian art has long garnered praise and acclaim internationally with artists such as M.F. Hussain and Souza selling canvases in the million dollar category, modern Pakistani art has invariably suffered the fate of an overlooked second child. Finally, it seems the tide is starting to turn. With an exhibition of contemporary and modern art from Pakistan opening at celebrated auction house Christie's this week, London collectors were introduced to the unexpectedly edgy face of paintings from Pakistan. We would all agree that great art is really born of struggle. It's really born of anxiety. Uh, and some of the political complications of Pakistan, some of the gender issues in Pakistan, spiritual issues in Pakistan, are borne out in the work of these artists. And that's what really makes it so relevant and so interesting. Um, each and every work of art is saying something, something that's really relevant to, to all of us today. And I think this is what is one of the great hallmarks of Pakistani art, and this is what makes it particularly important. The collection was an eclectic mix of artists stretching over several decades. Younger artists like Naiza Khan, whose armored sculpture drew much attention, shared space with veterans such as Zahur al Akhlaq and Anwar Said. But as an introduction, the event was definitely an eye-opener. Few attendees at the dinner and talk by Salima Hashmi knew that artists even existed in Pakistan. But clearly the event saw the blossoming of interest among some of the major collectors present. The universal feedback has been one of um, delight at being able to see the works, but people are incredibly impressed by the quality of the work. And everybody sees contemporary Pakistani artists really going international, as it were. Salima Hashmi, Dean of the School of Visual Arts at Beacon House University, flew in from Lahore specially to offer an engaging and articulate bird's eye view of contemporary Pakistani art, which she said is inextricably linked to Pakistani and international politics, gender identities and the exploration of popular culture. This is young art, it's iconoclastic, it's experimental and it's very, very good. So for Christie's to invite Pakistan to show some of its best art that's happening today is, I think, um, to mutual advantage. With a canvas from Pakistani artist Rashid Rana fetching over half a million dollars in New York earlier this month, and major players such as Christie's recognizing the need to push art from Pakistan as distinctive and saleable, it seems this may well be the year when Pakistani art goes global in a big way. With cameraman Nasir Khan, this is Fifi Harun reporting for Geo News, London.